Ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to let you know what I am doing, and you're going to have to do your own research. Do not, some of you are stupid, and no, I don't mince my words. I tell you exactly the way things are, and if you can't handle it, too bad. If you can handle it, too bad. And if you want to try to throw it back at me, too bad. Don't care. I am gifting the two nine billion dollars, nine billion nine hundred ninety nine million nine hundred ninety nine thousand nine hundred ninety nine dollars and ninety nine cents, two of them together. I'm attaching a copy of the 1099C filings along with the approval of those two because I also have the 400 billion, but we're not doing it that way. We're doing it with these two. And I am sending it to the Bureau of Fiscal Services to offset the public debt. Now, the Bureau of Fiscal Services only accepts certain types of offsets, and thus there must be a payment, check, money. So I'm giving them a bill of exchange, but international bill of exchange under the rules of the International Convention of UNCTRAL. I've already studied UNCTRAL since, what, 2011? So the rest of you who haven't, you just have to go over it. It's not that long. It's the International Convention of United Nations International Convention on blah, blah, blah. So where is the spelling? U-N-C-I-T-R-A-L. Did they put it in here? See? United Nations Convention on International Bills of Exchange. And international promissory notes. International convention on international blah, 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 blah. Okay? Now, remember, it has to say, I'm going to tell you this, y'all don't deserve this, but it has to say international bill of exchange at least twice. International bill of exchange, international bill of exchange. Twice. Do you see that? Oh, God, he did what I told him to do. All right? It has to. You. It doesn't work any other way. Now, the party it's coming from, my suggestion, all caps name, comma, estate. Because it has to be from one foreign country to another foreign country, i.e. one state to another state. So an estate is an entity. It's not a person. So it's a separate jurisdiction. It's a foreign jurisdiction. And it's a state. <laughs> anyway, hey. You comply with the stupid law and the provisions of the law. All right? But this is what I was doing. And I'm doing all the attachments. Pay attention. At the bottom right here, it says, where my attachment section? Oh, it don't have it on this one because this is the International Bill of Exchange. So it doesn't have the attachment on here. Let's see if I can show you guys the attachment. Hold on. Hold on. Created the letter first. So y'all just got to, we got to scroll up a little bit. Created the letter for C. Copies. Hey, that's um my phone. Y'all, y'all hear it? So I gotta go answer that. So we we'll talk to y'all again soon.